All right, thanks, Bob. Last night's Boise City Council meeting didn't end until 1 o'clock mm. in the morning following heated debate over expanding St. Luke's downtown campus. Yeah, Dozens signed up last night to speak about their proposal, and the longer the session went, the less likely it, it appeared that the council would actually take a vote, which they kicked down the road. Mm -hmm. Denny Hawkins was there and has our continuing coverage. Hundreds of people showed up to City Council last night to testify both for and against the St. Luke's Master Expansion Plan. Discussion lasting well into the night, City Council members deciding not to put it to a vote just yet. The proposed St. Luke's Master Plan would expand the facility onto Jefferson Street. Its growth, the hospital says, is necessary to improve the quality of care at St. Luke's. Our proposed Master Plan represents the next step in the innovation of health care a horizontally integrated care model designed to provide the very best care for our community. The expansion plan has drawn plenty of criticism from nearby neighborhoods over the past few months. Neighbors arguing the expansion takes away their access to downtown. The connectivity of Jefferson, I would say, is possibly the top concern. You're basically taking the only collector that our neighborhood has. The hospital introduced some modifications to the 30-year plan Tuesday night. The evolving proposal now calls for a bike and walking path on Bannock, as well as transit stops and bike lanes on Main and Idaho streets near the campus. Public testimony was expected to wrap up Tuesday, discussion lasting late into the night. We do have a defibrillator in the hallway, uh, <laughs> should that be necessary. After hours of discussion, many neighbors still say there's a better way. I'm offended by the trivial way that our concerns have been addressed. If the council is truly interested in what the impacted residents of the East End think about the St. Luke's expansion plan, they should ask them. Others say the expansion is good for business and good for families. I believe that the St. Luke's master plan is very consistent with Boise's traditional values. For my family and me, we simply want high quality health care close to home. If approved, the St. Luke's expansion plan would cost about $400 million. The hospital does say it would add four to 500 jobs right here in the Treasure Valley. And the council decided to meet again on July 7th to deliberate that proposal and possibly take a vote.